in the world of MMA. Some fights really change things for the fighters. These moments made them get better at fighting and handling their feelings. Each time they lost, it pushed them to learn new ways and become stronger. They worked on their weaknesses and tried new things in training. These battles helped them become champions and showed how tough they are. MMA is all about never giving up and always trying your best, and these fights proved that. Number 1. Michelle Paha vs. Tristan Connolly Michelle Paha, renowned for his flamboyant and acrobatic fighting style, suffered a humiliating loss due to over-reliance on flashy moves. Recognizing the need for a more balanced approach, he refined his technique, incorporating better control and timing. This adjustment proved pivotal, leading to a series of improved performances, demonstrating a more controlled and effective fighting style. Number 2. Max Holloway vs. Conor McGregor Max Holloway's struggle with takedown defense was exposed during his fight with Conor McGregor, emphasizing the necessity for improvement in this area. Committed to enhancing his defensive skills, Holloway embarked on a dedicated training regimen, which eventually contributed to a remarkable winning streak and cemented his position as a formidable fighter in the UFC. Number 3. Brock Lesnar vs. Frank Mir Brock Lesnar's initial loss to Frank Mir compelled him to reevaluate his aggressive approach, realizing the significance of patience and strategic maneuvering in the octagon. This realization prompted Lesnar to focus on refining his control and strategy, which subsequently led to a notable shift in his fighting style, showcasing a more composed and calculated performance in his subsequent fights. Number 4. Conor McGregor vs. Nate Diaz Conor McGregor's defeat at the hands of Nate Diaz exposed his energy and efficiency and highlighted the necessity for a more refined and sustainable fighting strategy. Acknowledging this, McGregor embraced a specialized training program, enabling him to cultivate better stamina and endurance. This intensive training regimen culminated in a triumphant rematch against Diaz, showcasing McGregor's enhanced physical and mental conditioning in the octagon. Number 5. Henry Cejudo vs. Demetrius Johnson Henry Cejudo's loss to Demetrius Johnson propelled him to broaden his fighting skill set, emphasizing the importance of diversifying his techniques. Determined to evolve into a more versatile and well-rounded fighter, Cejudo dedicated himself to comprehensive training, culminating in a significant victory over Johnson in a subsequent bout, underscoring his growth and adaptability as an MMA athlete. Number 6. Georges St. Pierre vs. Matt Serra Georges St. Pierre's unexpected loss to Matt Serra instigated a profound emotional struggle, prompting him to seek guidance from a sports psychologist. Through this process, St. Pierre learned to overcome his fixation on the defeat, fostering a resilient mindset. With renewed determination and mental fortitude, he returned to the octagon as a dominant champion, displaying an unparalleled level of focus and composure in his subsequent fights. Number 7. Dustin Poirier vs. Michael Johnson Dustin Poirier's defeat at the hands of Michael Johnson underscored the significance of adopting a more defensive approach in his fighting style. This pivotal adjustment facilitated a successful career trajectory, enabling Poirier to achieve notable victories and establish himself as a prominent figure in the world of MMA. Number 8. Francis Ngannou vs. Stipe Miocic Francis Ngannou's loss to Stipe Miocic served as a crucial lesson in the value of patience within the realm of his fighting style. This pivotal shift in his approach ultimately propelled Nganu to secure the coveted heavyweight championship, solidifying his position as a dominant force in the UFC. Number 9. Bass Rutten vs. Ken Shamrock Bass Rutten's defeat at the hands of Ken Shamrock prompted a focused effort to bolster his ground game skills, honing his submission techniques and enhancing his ground control. This commitment to refining his ground game ultimately translated into a series of impressive submission victories, showcasing Rutten's evolution as a multifaceted and skilled MMA athlete. Number 10. Amanda Nunes vs. Kat Zingano Amanda Nunes's loss to Kat Zingano exposed her struggles with performance anxiety during fights, necessitating a transformative approach to her mental and physical preparation. Seeking guidance from a sports psychologist and fostering a supportive training environment, Nunes embarked on a journey of self-discovery and growth. This significant shift in her approach enabled Nunes to transcend her previous limitations, establishing herself as one of the most dominant and resilient fighters in the history of MMA. In the world of MMA, tough losses can actually help fighters become even better. These 10 fighters all faced hard times, but they didn't give up. Instead, they worked hard and changed the way they fought. They became stronger and better at what they do. Their stories show us that even when things seem really tough, we can still come back and win. If you liked this, 
Remember to click the like button, share with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more cool stories about MMA fighters.